All right, boys, welcome back. We are 1910, where we left off last time. And let's see if we can make progress to the 2000 rating today. Uh, we're playing uh, basically a 2000. Let's see, count 2017, so we uh, should be safe. All right, and let's see how this goes. We're just going to get our pieces out. Go to Rio Lopez. Oopsie daisy. Haven't haven't learned this position, uh, this opening properly either. <laughs> I just don't like learning openings, honestly, but... I think I think I just go at this point. I think we can take. Wait, sorry, wait. If I take this, I go here. It's not the same as if the bishop was here though. Take here, this. He can he can just play that. I'm thinking of another line when the bishop's here, so that that doesn't work. I think I don't think I could actually take that. Um, what if I play this bishop move? Take. Wait, no. Bishop take. Take knight, take queen here, maybe moves back. Can't take here. I'm thinking too much. I'm just gonna play this. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, wait, take here. I'll take here. This doesn't work, so I'm gonna take. Yeah, I'm gonna take here. If he plays this, this is a check. I did not even consider that. <laughs> Whoops, I castle. I just lose a knight. I can protect. Or go all the way up. Alright, I'm just going to play it here. I don't want to get my queen too far up. It's just going to be a target. This knight is attacked though. So where could the knight move? Yeah, yeah. Maybe if I put it there, it could have played this. That just gains time and this is going to be a bit shaky. So once this moves, I'm going to castle. The question is, can he actually play this? I didn't even consider that. I think... No, I could just take that. Yeah. Oh, I did think of that, but... Does that actually work? Oh, uh, right. Do we have a check? We have a check here. Just takes. I don't see a progress there. Take this way. It's probably going to play this pull, pull move. I could castle take. I think, yeah, I think he wins a pawn there. Take this way. Still, it's the same idea. All right, then fine. We'll take this way, which is the pawn. Can I play this check still? Nope. Yeah, I'm not going to waste too much time here. So he grabs a pawn. Uh, we have bishop to develop, but I think I want to line the rook up first. Yeah, let's play this. So he has to protect this. You could just easily protect the knight. And then we'll connect the rooks or something. Okay, he defends that way. Uh, is he going to try to push it forwards? Just get this bishop out and bring the rook in and play for the center. We're also doing a bit uh, worse on time, so need to speed that up. He's, he's probably going to do this, I feel. But maybe I could try to put some pressure later on in the game with a bishop move like that. Okay. Kind of want to play this, trying to trap the rook. But we see this comes first. Take, take. I can take the pawn at this. If he wants to double the pawns up, then I'll take this. Uh, let's make sure take. What's the queen going to do after that? Don't see a decent follow-up. After I take, what happens? Yeah, this, this, this. And then what? I want to see a good follow-up, so try to grab this. Oh yeah, he takes this, we take here. So I think we grab the pawn back. We take this this way. Knight pops around. We should be good. We'll take that. Alright, so I kind of want to go here, target this pawn. Also maybe set this up. This, I don't know, is that is that kind of stupid? I would love to play this. If I do this, he's just going to push the pawn. This, how's he going to deal with that? Can't push the pawn, he loses this. Probably brings the rook here. So let's go for that. Yeah, bishop this way or this way? Let's do bishop this way. Also, there's this pawn. But currently, the knight's defending that. There's this and this, protected. Maybe go this way, attack here. Let's lift the rook up and try come this way. Or this way, all right. Um, let's go here. And um, he might play this, all right. And then I don't want to give my light squared bishop up here. Let's go back. This guy's playing really fast, all right. If I go here, this check doesn't work, or maybe it does. Let's go this way, maybe. Yeah, if pushes, we just take. Maybe we should have had this rook here. Yeah, it's going to target this pawn now. But, he uses the rook. 
I'm gonna come and defend. This guy's playing it fast as fuck, boy. He's trying to play for the clock, um, which is kind of annoying. But now we gotta speed it up. Okay, brings the queen closer. Takes that. Kinda wanna play this. Yeah, let's play this. Is he gonna do this? Can't. Plays a check, take. Oh, I just lost my queen. Oh, I did not see that. All right, take here. Hmm. I'll try to not tilt, but that's a very annoying thing to lose to. Oh yeah, just gonna take all the pawns now. Uh, push these pawns up. Yeah, and then it's over. All right. Yeah. Just, just not paying attention. Yeah, let's see this. I mean. To be honest, like, when I feel this annoyed about a loss, I just feel like not even playing, so... But yeah, the video is kind of short, so I'm going to continue, but this is very annoying. Just blunders. I uh, play this, this move, threaten and discover check. For some reason, I didn't realize that he's also explaining this. It's very poor. It's, it's because I, I tried rushing here. He put the time pressure on me. Yeah, and this is a straight blunder. I'm uh, looking at how would I play. There's two discover checks. So I'll probably just drop the queen back. And we'll be fine. Friend in the fork as well. Yeah. No. Oh. Yeah, that's quite poor. But yeah, let's go play another one. Yeah, let's go playing as white. We got the scotch. Probably going to trade here. Or maybe drop the bishop back. Okay, so we're going to play the Blumenfield. Let's see how he plays this. This is the correct move. But even then, it's a tricky game. And this is the wrong one. Alright, we get the knight out. He's not careful, he's trapped. If he goes here, it's just a fork. Uh, wait, wait, if he goes here, I'm trying to remember now. Check here. All right, we're gonna play this. I think we win a knight then, because this check, we just move and we're fine, I believe. So we play this. We could take like this, and then we, we could take this way. Okay, he's really thinking about this one. Okay, takes a check. Let's actually calculate now. I probably should have done that in my own time, but we just move here. Right, that's that's why I'm I'm pretty sure you just do that. I just move here. If he takes it. We just take. And the queen's still trapped. So we take here, let's just make sure, maybe the queen will take here, this and this. Yeah, the queen's still, still trapped. So, oh, why can't we just take this? All right. And then he resigns. So yeah, zero blunders, zero mistakes. This, this open is a, is a cheat code, <laughs> honestly. Yeah, 98.6%. Uh, well, we'll go for it. For those of you that don't know this opening, I'm not sure if I want to make it popular, but <laughs> I, I catch out so many people with this opening, honestly. Yeah, it's just it's a, it's a Blumenfield attack. Objectively, it's not good, but it's hard to find the right moves. This is a mistake. Uh, the right move is check, block, take, and you're attacking my rook. Therefore, after a full Q and take your rook, you take my rook, but the pressure continues. I'm threatening mate. You have to get get the knight out, and I don't know. You develop your knight, and then you castle, and you still have a decent position. Although, again, objectively, the the engine doesn't like it too much. But yeah, that's that. So it takes here, yeah, it makes it worse. You yeah, check, move up, take, take. Queen's trapped. I don't know what he was going for there. I think he forgot my queen was there or something. And yeah, that's it. That's checkmate. I mean, not checkmate. You lose a rook, uh, the queen. So here we are, 1913. I'm still upset about the loss. Loss. I feel like we really should have grabbed those 10 points off that guy. Very elementary tactic. I blundered, but you know, it's room for improvement. Things like that happen. And you know, there's there's many games. Like I played like probably around f over a thousand games on this account. So one game isn't going to define whether I reach 2,000 in time or not. But yeah, 1913 we finish on, and I'll see you here tomorrow.